Did you know hearing loss can strike at any age, and there are many reasons for it? This next story is about a local mother who struggled to maintain a relationship with her young sons after losing her hearing. But now, thanks to technology, her relationship with them has been restored. Four year old Caden Myers loves playing robots with his mommy. There's robots that you, that you have a gun. But the interaction between the two wasn't always so good. My husband would constantly have to come in and try to help with the communication. Kathleen Myers, a mother of three boys, was born with severe hearing loss. But her life was turned upside down a year and a half ago. The 45 year old lost her hearing completely when she became critically ill on vacation. It was extremely tough. A lot of frustration, a lot of um, crying. I mean, let's be honest, a lot of crying. Unprepared to live in total silence, she did her best to read her son's lips. But one day after seeing a specialist, the doctor told her she was a candidate for cochlear implants. So she went for it. A month later, when I was tucking my children to bed, it's pitch dark. My son was telling me, uh, talking to me in the dark, and he said, Mom, you're the best mom in the world. And I went, what? Oh, my God. I understood it. No lip reading, no light, just hearing only. Seven months after that, she got the other implant. This is an internal device that is implanted inside the head. The technology has really changed over the years. Dr. Chris Epstein says more people are benefiting from the technology. If hearing aids aren't working for you, if you have a severe to profound hearing loss, there is another option. Like Myers found out. But it's just an amazing um, experience. She's quite an amazing woman as well. Now, if you think you could benefit from this, there is a free health screening this uh, Saturday. It's going to be from 10 to 1230. Again, it's free to the public, and it's at the Hotel Albuquerque at Old Town. Matt. Great information there, Elizabeth.